Today we are going to learn how to make a pumpkin pecan cheesecake. To start off, we assess our ingredients by putting our ingredients for the filling on one side and the ingredients for the crust on the other side. Next, we will preheat the oven to 400 degrees to roast our pecans. Take your pecans and look for about eight or so, the same number as your serving dish, to decorate the dishes when they're finished. Don't choose broken pieces. Next, take two cups of pecans and lay them on a dry cookie sheet. Make sure that they are in a single layer so they will roast evenly. While the pecans are roasting, Take two tablespoons of butter and add two tablespoons of brown sugar and one teaspoon of salt for the remainder of the crust mixture. Once the pecans are finished roasting, take them out of the oven using oven mitts. Next, chop the roasted pecans. and add them to your crust mixture. Next, spoon the crust mixture evenly into your serving dishes. Now we can start the filling. In a large mixing bowl, combine one package of cream cheese, One teaspoon cinnamon. A half of a teaspoon of cloves. And a dash of nutmeg. These spices will give the dish its pumpkin pie flavor. Mix them all together so that it is smooth before adding a cup, uh, excuse me, a half a cup of white sugar, a half a cup of brown sugar, and a half a cup of yogurt. Next add three fourths of a cup of canned pumpkin puree. Mix it all up. You want to get it as smooth as possible before you fold in two cups of whipped cream. Make sure you fold it in instead of mixing so that it keeps a fluffy consistency. It should look quite smooth like cheesecake. Next, spoon your filling mixture on top of your crust mixture in your serving dishes. Make sure you use up all of your filling mixture. Next, top it with whipped cream for decoration. And don't forget the pecans you picked out earlier. look like this. Ta-da! Ta -da!